Alright. Besides, Pac-Man knows sometimes that can happen. Yo, what is up, everybody? Good to see everybody here. Hopefully the mic is working just fine. Yes, it is. Keith, say hi. Hi, I'm Keith. Anyway, my buddy Keith here is the guy who loaned me the Super Nintendo you saw me use to play Crowdo Trigger. Pac-Man, good to see you here. This is a surprise stream of sense. I did tell a few people I was going to do this, but I didn't really put it on the schedule. Hell yeah, see, he's using my robo emote. Look at that robo emote. It's nice. I I, I did that. Good yeah, man. I know, I know. <laughs> I love that robo emote. A lot of people loving it. Um, a lot of people love the fist bump emo. Oh, yeah, he's, he already used it up here. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Everybody loves the fist bump emo, even though why would you fist bump knuckles? That's just silly. I mean, why not? You'd hurt your, <laughs> you'd probably hurt your hand. Has anyone actually fist bumped knuckles though? Um, no, they're not idiots. <laughs> but knuckles is always trying to be a bro. <laughs> you know, that's what, that's how we do it here. So, uh, we're going to play some retro stuff on the Super Nintendo uh, which obviously, like I said, is his. Uh, we're going to play games I'm not familiar with, I've never really played. Um, I don't know how many of these games you've actually played. I've played all of them um, to a certain extent. I bought a little box, a little grab bag, if you will, and uh, I think uh, the idea is Christian to play them on his own later. I'm going to leave them with him. But I brought a couple two-player ones. I uh, figured we'd start with the Pirates of Dark. Pirates of Dark Water. I've heard some things about this game, and I'm very interested to see how it works up. Go ahead and start it up, sir, and we will switch over to the game playing screen. Here he is. Hey, the cool roll. The cool roll. Yeah. Just like a bulldozer. All right. Are you going to read this? Nah, nah, nah. We don't read retro shit. <laughs> sure, I'm pretty sure I've watched a stream or two, and half it is just reading. Yeah, no, no. I I read like RPGs and shit some, most of the time, but like any of these retro streams where the the story's like very like hard to really pick up anyways. It's just like, eh, we. I mean, I guess the the, the story doesn't really matter. That no, much, but no. um. This show was going to be great. It was great in the 90s, and it was like the super cool lore where the whole world was covered in dark water, which was basically like this black sludge that was like almost personified. Yeah. And these guys are heroes, and they had like these treasures of rule, they called them. That was the only thing they could purify the dark water. Um, and it was awesome, but there's 13 treasures of rule. They make a big point of it in the intro the whole time, and the show ended after they got the seventh one. So, big cliffhanger. Never knew, never knew how it ended. There's also like a six-issue comic, and then there's this game and a Genesis game. And I can, I could not get enough of Pirates of Dark Water back in the day. Um, to be honest, this is a fairly easy beat 'em up. I think the first time I played it, we just got through it, no problem. So, to answer Pac-Man's question, is Keith going to be the one carrying? Probably not. It's going to be pretty equal. But it'll be fun. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. So I'm tired of people carrying me. I'm like, I'm a fat fuck, you know? I get a little heavy sometimes. Well, if uh, that was what he meant by that, <laughs> way, I'd get a cart and <laughs> throw your ass on that instead. <laughs> all right, I think you're player one. I am oh. player one? All right, all right. Two players start. Uh, we don't need to look at the options on the Hey. All right, so Tula's your fast but weaker character. Ren is you know, balanced, and then Ayaz is the... You know, very strong, but he's slow. Yep. Um, strong think, and slow is how we like him. Yeah, I like him in this one. Look, all right. There's all seven of the treasures that they got through the whole oh, show. Oh, oh, oh man. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. The monkey bird. All right, you ready? I'm just trying to figure out the rules, so... I think uh, a, a is your special battle 
uh, end up hurting you in a bit. But emergency use of Alright, so Y is like X is hard. And then B's jump. Alright. You can do like, you know, your standard like guy kick, like turtle style. Yeah. yeah. I guess you punch for some reason. Uh, yeah, my pizza. Come on, come on down here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all right. But yeah, we played a fair amount of beat 'em ups on the channel. We played, a, we do play a lot of Streets of Rage. I've seen a couple of them. Yes. Cracking skulls, what is going on? Hey dude, just making some stops on Twitch before I get off for the day. I passed out watching Archer stream me yesterday. Uh, much much love, brother. Alright, Kraken, thank you for stopping by. Much appreciated. You're always a dude. You're always a good dude. And uh yeah, hopefully you and your family have a great day, man. Just for people who are curious, yes, we are still having our board game stream later this evening. Nothing, which is Civ 6. So, yes, Pac Man will continue our Civ 6 game from, um, the last couple weeks. So, yes. yes. Pac Man is currently winning. Oh, good for you, Pac Man. Not by much, but he's winning. So, Christian, who's boss? Fuck him. Christian likes to think he's good at board games just because he owns a lot, but. <laughs> it just. It just makes me look impressive. I'm all about looking impressive and not being impressive, alright? <laughs> Something. It, it's all about the magic, dude. If you have no magic, they don't stick around. Fucking, if you expose the magician, well, no one's gonna. I'm watch the show. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Fuck the show, I'm here. I'm trying to help. Guest star, the green flea. Yes, the green flea. Oh, we drop. Uh, you know I'm not feeling good. I told Archer last night a stupid sickness hit me out of nowhere yesterday morning. Um, hopefully uh, it's not like COVID. Hopefully it's not COVID. Definitely, it's not COVID. That's tough. I heard it sucks. I've, I've yet to have to deal with that, but... Well, I mean, I got the vaccine in May. Still wear masks around. Because... Yeah, it... I, I've only gotten sick, like, once in the past 18 months. I think wearing masks and stuff like that, so... Yeah. I probably just keep wearing one a lot. <laughs> it, it, it was weird that I came down with some weird-ass cold the other uh, last month or month or two ago and it was it stuck around forever i like that for a couple people uh -oh. oh nice i forgot you could knock we got we gotta jump this shit we could do it, man. there we go well, i forgot you could knock him in the pits um pac-man says we gotta he's gotta make up for that uh all the beatings he's took he's taken in res arcana i'm like wait is this thing destroyable yes there we go because that's why i got crushed by him when i got that water man. Waited to destroy it. Um, but yeah, I mean, we can't be good at everything. No. And there is that matter of luck in a lot of them, so. Um, some have luck, some it's very mitigated. I prefer ones where it's very mitigated. Alright, uh, Kraken Skull says it's not COVID. I'm feeling a bit better, I just need more rest. Rest up, sir. Yeah, get get some rest. You got got more Final Fantasy break li break limit damage to play, so. Is that a different board game? No, no, he plays uh Final Fantasy uh Ominous Opera or whatever that uh, mobile game is. Oh yeah, it's like and, and every time Raiden, I go in Bravis Exodus yeah. or some I, every time I see him play it. All he is is doing like max damage, crazy ass damage with these characters. It, it's the, it's basically the Dissidia. No, it's the Dissidia one. It's Dissidia Opera, like. Oh, I. It's Final Fantasy Dissidia there's like, Opera op, Opus. I forget the name. There's like five Kraken. of them. I played the original, like. 
don't know, it was one where it was just general, like, all the Final Fantasy universes were in the game, and you could be like, wow. Yeah, yeah, the original Dissidia, yeah. I No, 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 you're, that's a different one. This is, oh. like, the original mobile game. I'm oh, the play. original mobile game. He, and now there's, like, Opera Omnia. Yeah, that's, that's the one he plays. I swear they just throw in a bunch of nonsense words. That's the game. Yeah. <laughs> Is that a one-up? Yeah. Ah. But I think it was for you because it's your picture. <laughs> no, we both got it. Oh, four. Man, this guy's a big pirate. They didn't really mince with words. <laughs> well, at least like in Batman Returns, that, that beat him up. Like, you fight ones like that and they're just called Bat Bomb. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. I've been... Splitting my streams between that and Breath of the Wild. So, ooh, yeah, that's good. Was that his uh, first playthrough, though, or are you just continuing on like two, hour 200 in Breath of the Wild? <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. You never know. I, I, I haven't caught his streams playing that, so it must be on days I just am normally busy for checking his channel. Because there's just some days I don't get on Twitch, I just like, I don't even. Just because I got so much going on half the time when I'm off stream. Um, and there's nothing wrong with putting that much time in the breath of the wild. No. Um, I think when the pandemic first started, I was just working from home, which did not involve as much work as I originally wanted to do. So a lot of times it was just like, well, I'm done. I guess I play some breath of the wild. So by like the end of month two, it was like 110 hours in. And I was like, oh shit. Nice. <laughs> God, this guy. Fucking oh, the the Badass, man. Hey, you know the show I don't know. He was like the big villain for the most part. He was trying to get all the treasures for himself and uh selfish prick. <laughs> Level clear, fuck yeah. Man. Yeah <laughs> That's and and you know what we do on this channel? We fist bump. Hell yeah. Yeah, Hell yeah. And I drop fuck. He's like, well, I he's, drop? And, No, I don't care because it's not my shit. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Damn cords nowadays, pulling controllers down. Uh, you were not like sitting at the uh, extent of it. Fair enough. All right. I don't know. I like not having to worry about uh, the battery life of my wireless controller. Nowadays, like my PS4, if I have that hooked up, I have to have one connected to the system charging, and then that one that runs low, just switch to. If it's corded, I never have to worry about it, but then I need it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I don't know. Wireless controllers just annoy me because it's just like, I, I think, I always forget about, like, I see the warning and I'm like, meh, I'll, I'll be fine. And then I forget about it. And then the controller dies on you at the worst possible moment. Well, most games at least pause it when that happens. Um, the problem is you can't exactly do that when you're playing online. That's true. That's true. So that's usually the worst possible moment. I'm, I'm about ready to do some Hadouken or some fucking uh, fatality on someone or I'm getting them to the point I'm going to and then sure it is. I've been doing that with the uh, Switch Pro controller because it, it warns you. It's like, hey, the battery's low, but then you can still play like another four hours. It'll just warn you every twenty minutes. Yeah. So it's half like. How long can I play until this actually? Happens? Exactly. Nice. Nice. Yeah, that's right. No more. It's the pit. Ah, fuck you, spikes. Man. 
you said when you said tattoo man, I thought, oh, description. No, no name. No, nope, okay. no fix the name. <laughs> I totally, totally forgot that story. I got a lot of time in the back of the screen. They keep or, running oh, into just, the spikes. Just throw the big fire in. I will just stand here. Just stand here. Okay. I'm just gonna stand here. Okay. Haha, uh -huh, you got can't get me. Let's <laughs> try. Alright, come, come on. Walk, come on, walk forward. Maybe take a step back. Yeah, yeah. Ah, there we go. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Celebration! Uh, Alright, let's see, that's how that's how we do it here. Why do the work when the game does the work for you? This game was <laughs> As I say that, Chris Church is like, I need a death of this fight. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Arctic Fox, welcome, welcome. This game reminds me of Streets of Rage. Let's go. Yeah, we were... We were saying some of the early history of the game and how it had a TV show and everything tied into it. But yeah, they made this beat em up for that uh, lesser known TV show they created, so. I read some article recently how people still want a remake of this. I'll, I fully support that. <laughs> well, people really did enjoy this, and, you know, it wasn't very long lived, and. You know, I can find the link. It, 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 the... In general, people enjoy being. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's. Well, this is in that hate too. Well, be about square. That's in there. This is perfect uh, uh, IP for a game. Yeah. yeah, it works out well. Oh yeah. You know, a boss fight is coming when the stage starts rumbling. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> or we could be in a cave. That naturally happens too. Where they just disposed to this town. Sick of me. These guys are called. Yeah. Jeez. I mean, I, I think mean... they were the first enemies that popped up, but you never read them. I read like every other one. <laughs> By the way, Arctic Fox, how's your day going, dude? Yeah, it's just the naming convention. It's like they they ripped off Mega Man, like straight from Mega Man. <laughs> well, like, like, we, yeah, he's he'll, uh, he's tattooed, so if you beat him, you know, like you yeah, him yeah, you get a tattoo. <laughs> well, that's Tall Man. If you beat him, you grow an inch. <laughs> if, you're, if you beat the big pirate, well, I don't need to tell you what happens. <laughs> <laughs> D rider. Fucking dick rider. <laughs> Alright. And they're running into the flames. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess we so just make sure we don't get ambushed from behind. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, just had some breakfast and coffee. I hope you guys are well too. Yes we are. We're very well. We're excited to play some games with you guys here for a bit. We're excited to watch the football a little later on. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this sad guy right here likes the New York Giants. Uh, hey, you man. Know. Hey, hey. You don't have to throw me under the bus yet. No, no, I'm not throwing you under the bus. I just said, you know, it's sad, but, you know, I, I understand things got worse when Eli left. He didn't think that was going to happen. But... Oh, I, I, I mean, it had to happen eventually. I can't play for No, no, I meant, like, uh, you didn't think it was going to get worse. Oh. <laughs> Eli was looking pretty rough in these last uh, few years. Oh, yeah. But apparently can throw the ball 10 yards. But, uh, it's all right. I, I think this is probably karma for me getting so much shit for the Browns. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Look at them Browns now. They're awesome. Tattoos make people more tough. Like, plus 10 to fighting skill, strength, or dexterity, I thought. Well, I mean, that's what I thought when I was a kid, and I put on those, like, tattoos that were temporary. I thought I'd get, like, a stat boost. It didn't quite work out so well. 
Well, you didn't get a stat boost? I'm pretty sure I did. No, I mean, I never got off the bench on my basketball team. I so. <laughs> <laughs> well, we played basketball before. You were uh, pretty decent. No, I, I, yeah, that's all I could do. Don't ask me to do much else. Yeah, I, remember, I, can't I remember. Now. I remember. I got. Uh, I stopped you from shooting. I was just like, "You're shorter than me. You're slower than me. I'm not letting you shoot anymore. You gotta, you gotta take it to the floor." <laughs> yeah. And that basically up. You like made like three three pointers. I was like, "Fuck this shit." <laughs> Yeah, I went all Steph Curry on your ass and you just like okay. I don't I, believe, I, I don't appreciate it. I don't this. believe Steph Curry was in the league last time he played last <laughs> But hey, I'm just using a modern day reference. <laughs> I wasn't gonna be like, well, I, I just went all John Stockton on your ass. Probably, you probably kids might that. not know. The guy he always wants to talk about John Stockton. Hey, the Jazz are awesome. <laughs> Fuck you. I mean I could be like, well, Don Mitchell is like the future of our team. Are you still a jazz fan? Yeah, I love jazz. Jazz are great. We got Rudy Gobert. We got we got Donovan Mitchell. What could go wrong? What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this guy? Is this guy the boss? Yes. There's yeah. It's like it's, huh? like, it's like Smee, from Peter Pan, except you know with a peg leg. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this guy! Gotta watch out, man. He's got a butcher knife. Fuck now, hopefully we're all wearing cups. Fucking meat cleaver. Yeah, it's a yeah, it's a meat cleaver. Fuck. <laughs> meat cleavers are dangerous, man. Ow. They hack you. <laughs> dude, I get excited every time I see a meat cleaver when I play uh, Streets of Rage. Oh yeah? Oh yeah, I'm like, dude, I can't wait to just wing this thing across everyone. Dude. Nice. And it just like cuts that. through every everything. I haven't played Streets of Rage 4 at this point. I got a copy of it, but I just haven't gotten around to it. Like they say in Lord of the Rings, never un underestimate the dwarves. Well, hopefully we can get you over at some point, some random day, we can do it, because I it, played the shit out of that is game. That, uh, can you play that online, too? Yes. Because I have it, we could do it that way. Yes, well. we could. that would be definitely awesome if we could do it that way. Can you just join the Discord and ch chat? Yeah, it yeah. works. If I ever got off my ass and started streaming, <laughs> yeah, I know. that would help too. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I know, uh, it's just, I start doing this and it's like, everybody's like, everybody, like, friends and stuff I know is like, man, I wonder if I should be doing this too, or I could be doing this. Like, the conversation gets brought up. Now. Right, right. And, you know, it's... He says that uh, he's 100% sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, it's it's online playable for sure, so... I was, I was pretty confident, but not playing it. Well, the problem is, if you played, like, local co-op, you can play four people. If you oh. play online, it's only up to two. That's the only problem. Do you think we're getting two other people in here? No, I'm, I, no, no, not in this fucking small-ass kitchen. I didn't know if you wanted to break that wall. No, I, I don't. I don't want to, well, uh, where would we put them, like, except on our lap? No, and I, I know that would excite some people, but... Well, I literally, I think we, we have to break that wall down to get someone else <laughs> Fair enough. But, uh, no. Um... Uh, I, I played it a few times with uh, my, my buddy Jeff, Mr. J, if you guys seen him on the stream. And, you know, we enjoy it. Uh, granted, you need a break, but I'm always I'm always playing the survival mode on that game from the DLC. That that thing is just been, like, the best thing ever for that franchise. I'm super glad they, I'm super glad they installed that in the game. Mr. J! <laughs> I, I got distracted. I figured you could handle it. What the? Well, I said you finish him off and then you just let him, like, fucking hit you in the nuts. Well. My nuts were just out there, ready for them to smack. Come on, bitch. There we go. Fuck it, I had to give her a kiss. That was a big thing in the show, that they had these, uh, they're just called monkey birds, and it's exactly what you think it is. <laughs> 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 I 
But they were they were like they could talk, they were intelligent, but they uh were like enslaved. Oh my god. And that's why at the beginning of the level you had uh, one of them was a companion that was Ren. So the character Ren he would come in with a monkey bird carrying. <laughs> he was more or less the comic relief. Man, these guys like to celebrate. I love, oh. I love this show. I miss it. <laughs> well, unless this guy's actually got a name. Yuri. Not bow pirate. <laughs> bow I'm, going on, I'm going on a walk somewhere, but I hope you have a good rest of your stream and day. And we'll lurk for support. Thank you, my friend. Fist pump to you. Yeah, and have thanks. a good one. Yeah, that is one of those things like changing the stream schedule would be kind of different. Kind of suck, but kind of nice too. Because I kind of want to like cut back a little bit. Hey, what are you going to change it to? Because you were doing like Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. Well, like, a board game one on Sunday. Well, I, I do Monday. I do RPGs Monday through Friday. You do it every day? Yeah. I thought you were taking like two days to do Thursday. And then I was doing board game Sunday and Monday nights. And then just one, I just tried to do something else randomly throughout the week, whether it's Wednesday or Thursday evening. Gotcha, gotcha. And that's kind of what I've been doing lately. Well, what are you planning to do? Um, it just depends on the job I get. What schedule they offer me. Did you apply for anything that you're hoping to get here? Um, I've had, uh, two phone interviews so far from two different places. Like recently? Yes. Like this week or? Uh, last week. Not this week. When are you supposed to hear anything I, else? I have you? no idea. I've just recently applied to some place in Finley, the, the newspaper that they have there, and then I applied okay. a couple other graphic design jobs pop up in the last day or two also, and I'm going to apply to those here tonight. Yeah, you got to keep that even if you find one that would be ideal. Yeah. Yeah, I've totally been applying to somebody from the something. There we go. Well, when I interview people, I usually try to give them a day like, hey, I'm here from Las Vegas, and if not, make sure they reach out. Just, I like to make sure people, like, know one way or the other, because that is the thing that really bothers me when applying for jobs, just not hearing anything. Well, I guess I didn't get it. I never fucking talked to me. <laughs> Yeah, well, some people, I mean, a lot of these companies don't feel that they have to be obligated to let you know. Sure, but it's, I think it's just it, it, it would be <laughs> a, it, I, I call it common courtesy, sure, but yeah, it would be courteous to let them know. Hey, well, sorry. It's like, you just weren't qualified and you weren't good enough to meet our standards, aka someone in house knew this other fuck, and uh, we're not hiring. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've had that one. Remember before I got my, uh, started working at my current company? I think that's the last sleep in the Ah. If you, you want to get that done before you can. I don't know how to get it down. Maybe you have to buy stuff in there? I don't know. Maybe. Wow. Damon showing up and using the Reaper Mass Effect. That's his entrance, basically. Uh, yeah, feeling. It actually said Big Melon. <laughs> it was a Big Melon. Not wrong. <laughs> it's not, but I just didn't think I, I you know, it was going to tell me what I'm getting. Oh my god, it's like I never ate them. Yeah. yeah. What's going on, Damon? Uh, Damon is actually one of my good friends at IRL that I play a lot of board games with. Hey, Damon. Keith. This is Keith. Keith is literally one of my good friends from uh, back in the days of War of College. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, has a fascinating love of pretty much everything I enjoy, for better or worse. So. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So we're playing my Super Nintendo right now. I brought him a handful more games, and we're playing a pirate. You kind of have to say it. That's how we say it. Yeah. <laughs> yes. 
Yes, if you're not saying it like that, you're not saying it correctly. That's, that's a fair assessment. <laughs> you have the new Streets of Rage by the OG that, well, he'll hear the response here. <laughs> you have to forget their delay. Well, did he join in after you said it? Um, yeah, he joined in. Got experience in classics, he said. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I'm still looking forward to that new turtle feed about that's supposed to come out. Oh, yeah, I almost uh, brought the turtles in time for this. Oh, oh, that, oh, fuck yeah. That, that is good. literally like. Dude, if I, I have to make a like, favorite games list, period. That's probably. Really I'm actually surprised you didn't bring that for me. But well, I did kind of say bring stuff I've not really played before, so. Well, you specifically said not available on the Switch. Which that's not, but. I don't know, I've played so much of that game. I thought, yeah. thought this one would be a this better. I mean, I'm fine with this too, so it didn't matter. But, yeah, I, I just knew for streaming purposes people would love to see it regardless, but... You can always borrow it later. Oh, I know. What the, is this a clown? <laughs> no, it's a Jargus. <laughs> Fuck! Oh. Damn right, looks like it. Oh! Samurai with a whip. I can't get up. There we go. Fuck you. Oh, I tried to get the, the heavy attack in me. He didn't like that. Well, you work on him. I'll try to keep these guys at bay. You take the hard part. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you let me know when you want to trade. Yeah, I'll get it in there. I'll get in there. Yeah, you can do it. Ah! If we get him in the middle, we can at least hit him from either side. Oh, yeah. Yeah! I just had a seizure. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Level clear. Woo! I said it when we started this, but it's it's not that hard a game. I mean, that was... I think those were my first two deaths or something besides maybe falling in a pit. <laughs> yeah, let's not talk about that. <laughs> That's such a happy little jingle. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, exactly. And then you get this. <laughs> Fucking all these dead ass trees. Fuck. Oh. I mean, it'll get a little harder. No, I want it streamlined easy the entire time. No, no, we, we play with the games a lot of difficulty on this channel. Well, we can. Oh. Nice to have a little palette cleanser. Yes. Trust me, my 100% of Crash Bandicoot, definitely, I am so happy we moved on from that. <laughs> I never got into Crash Bandicoot. I, I enjoyed it. Like I, I remember playing uh, Uncharted 4 when you had to do the level, and I was like, this is why I never played this shit. I hate it. <laughs> It, I don't know. I've always enjoyed Crash Bandicoot. I just knew the first one was super hard. And I was just so happy, like, five sessions later, finally getting 100%. And I'm like, all right, we can move on to number two. Well, it, I think that's... I never played it when it was. We didn't have... I didn't have a PlayStation. I think it's easier. The OG was easier. Than the... Than the new remaster, yeah. Okay. Uh, so no banjo or DK country kind of games. Um, I mean, if I got them, I'll play them. I don't mind. It's just getting. Them. I have all the Donkey Kong countries, but they're also all on. Uh, uh, yeah. Which I'm on. Yeah. I love those games. Now that's a game I like. That's probably one of my favorite games. Platformers like Donkey Kong Country. Those are. 
I didn't, again, didn't grow up with the Nintendo system, so I didn't get to play a whole lot of the Donkey Kong series growing up. I played a little, not much. Well, I think this one was my first system that was my own. It's the very Super Nintendo. And it came with Donkey Kong Country, so I still have the, the awkward... Donkey Kong Country came with the bundle, but it didn't have the box for it. It just came with the manual. Wait, is Crash similar to Banjo or the DK games? I mean, it's still called a platformer. It's, a, it's more of a 3D platformer. A lot of times you run towards the screen and towards the screen. Yeah, or, yeah, the views, like, all all the views in Crash, for better or worse, is all 3D. Like, yeah, um, whereas Donkey Kong Country is almost exclusively side-scrolling. Yeah. I should do, like, 64 games. Yeah. yeah. I've never played Banjo for Super Nintendo, so... I've played a little bit, but again, I never got into it that much. I did get into Taku's Bad Birthday, which is basically Banjo Kazooie with an R rating. <laughs> I've, I've heard good things about that game. Um, it's a lot of fun, and I was at, like, the right mindset to, like, really dig the humor. Yeah. But I'm sure the humor now is kind of, like, super low ground. There was a part of Man King where I think it's maybe the first or second boss, where there's just this giant shit pile called the Great Mighty Pooh Sings Opera, mm. and you have to throw toilet paper into his mouth. <laughs> There we go. The new bananas are so good for you. I know, right? Like, they need full health. Sometimes you're just craving a little potassium in your day. But, but yeah, we're, uh... Yeah, this stream has been great. We even did a 12-hour stream, you know? That was, uh... That was fun. What did you do on the 12-hour um, we, uh, we played some games, some Jackbox games, we played, uh, while mostly the thing was featured, we had a Jenga thing set up. So when people put in subs or donated enough bits, I would move two blocks and see how long I'd keep the tower going. And when the tower fell, I spun a little spinner wheel, and whatever it landed on was the next game I went to. With or nice. like, some games were just games I haven't really played. Some games were just games that had specific like. So if it landed on Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Solid Extreme Mode, oh, or if it was Streets of Rage, it was Mania Plus. You know, um, ridiculousness if it was games I was familiar with, but other games like Metroid, I'd never really play Metroid. So it's just like playing Metroid. Um, other games were just like, you know, visit some, check out like games that I haven't played in forever, like I can do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, stuff like that. It was just a variety. And, uh, yeah. Uh, the tower fell like three times. Yeah, you just reset. You can be like, all right, subs. <laughs> Are you, uh, you've been doing this for a while, uh, basically since the beginning of the year? Yes. Right? Yes. So they haven't done it yet, an extra life program where you can raise money for one of the children's hospitals. Ah, uh, no. You remember you joined me for mine, except I didn't stream it. Yeah, you weren't streaming it. You were just. I, I guess. Posted like shit on Facebook and Twitter and that sort of thing. Um, basically, with the game in hand of what I was playing. Yeah, see, this is where it would be super cool to do it now. Yeah. Now that at least one of us has a platform, has it all set up, and at least have some uh, followers, on it, some steam. If yeah. I were to do it, it'd be like, Christians watch well, and eat and play. Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, I, I'm just like, I, I still don't feel comfortable enough doing that because I don't feel like I got enough of a following yet to do it. I mean, I got a little bit here, but... Well, to be fair, um... Like, the 12-hour stream kind of opened my eyes as to me being like, I don't think my following is enough yet for this kind of shit. 
so... Well, to, to be fair, I think it's, it's... If you post it on, like, Facebook and stuff, like... Which I do. I got, I got, um... You know, I exceeded my goal, and I didn't have any of this, so it's kind of like just an excuse to be able to do that. Hit... Because that's supposed to be 24 hours. Hit every... Time frame, I guess. Yeah. For people to pop in. As long as you're not doing it on the day, that was kind of my goal. They do it on, like, November 1st, or the first Saturday in November, something like that. Yeah. I would probably be like, no, I'm going to do it October 25th instead. So, like, I might be, like, willing to do, like, a 24 hour, like, board gaming thing, like, if I had several people willing to do it, like, once. I could do like live board games and shit like that. Cause I certainly don't want to be up for no 24 hours. Like, I don't think I, I can I, physically do that. I mean, it's rough. I mean, I barely made it through that when I did it. Like, I, I barely make it through 12 hours, let alone. Like, I, I, I'm I one of those guys throughout life that needed an F to get through their day. So, like, <laughs> trying to stay up that late all the time, like, or just that extensive amount and not sleeping, I don't know if I could get away with that. It's rough. Especially at my age now, so. Sure. I mean, I did that. I could that. do it. I could do it if I was, like, ten years younger, maybe. Well, I did it two years ago. Um, so, I mean, it wasn't terrible, but you saw me at the YouTube going for a little bit. Zombies yeah, and we played, uh, well, the most notable thing I remembered from that was, uh, the takeaway was the, uh, Jay and Silent Bob, uh, Nintendo game. That, that, that was, that was a whole different time. That was, was that different? Yeah, we I, I could have we did it that, no, that day. No, no, because that, I didn't even have it then. But that was, like, one of the last times you came over. Okay, okay. We played it because that is on the Switch, but it's, uh, also a Nintendo cart, which is what I have. Yeah. No, that was because that stream was like two years ago. Yeah, I was trying to think of that. I, you know, time flies, so it's like, yeah. no, I could have swore we did something else other than zombies that day. I don't remember what the other one was. We might have because um, your girlfriend was with you, so we didn't play too much because you didn't want to be there. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. She was there. She fucking held your cat. Oh, yeah. She yeah. wanted to steal our cat. She still wants to steal your cat. Oh, Jenga's a great cat. Uh, Bring that's full circle. That's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's like, hey, you want to go hang out with Keith? She's like, you know, Jenga. <laughs> that's literally what I get told. I'm like, well, I guess. You know there's people there, right? <laughs> yeah, well, I can't remember that. Oh, no. I'm worried, like, you know, probably not for a while. You can just probably go through so I don't know how many more you should have. But I have one other cat. I got to so we'll totally get another cat if and when Jake dies. I know. And it's not going to be nearly the same. Oh, yeah, that's true. Speaking of that, uh, I got a story to share with you off the stream. Okay. Because I'm not, I'm not going to get judged. Or I'm not, well, not me being judged, but I'm not going to. I know I can hold a few dirty laundry. <laughs> yeah, and I, yeah, it's just they kind of hit a little home, and I, uh, I, I know some people that watch the stream ride played already just on, on Discord or whatever, but like, that's fair. Yeah, I'm yeah, not gonna... we're going to uh, watch the at least the early games for the NFL. So yeah, plenty of time for that. Plenty of time. So. Yeah, you guys suck. I'm, sure, I'm pretty sure that's right. Just, just to clarify. No, no, no. Dick Ryder, <laughs> but like, it, it just seems natural. I mean, that guy looks like he took dick, so. <laughs> really? You just stood there. No, okay. I went down. The spikes. Always did on your own. 
Ah! Drop all them spikes, asshole. Aha, uh -huh. caught you. You got eight lives, you got this. You got this, so chat, what's up? <laughs> Wait, that guy just walked past me? I'm sorry. I told you. <laughs> I believe I already said that before you did it again. <laughs> Nothing a little confirmation doesn't help, you know? Away from him. Now the so like the greatest thing about the so far the streaming I think is that the people like I've met a lot of awesome people doing this. It's been it's been super awesome. Like some I even consider uh, you know pretty decent friends at this point. You know? I mean, that, that seems like a huge highlight to me. Uh, part of why I would like to do it, I just don't do gaming consistently enough. Uh, usually, uh, and maybe then, 10, 10 to midnight, and maybe every other Thursday. Well, uh, uh, no, I mean, it's like, you just gotta find time. Like, I know my buddy Turret Man, and I don't know if he's gonna show up here or not, because if he has time, he'll be able to I know he only streams two nights a week, and it's like three hours a uh, three hours those two nights. But you know he's not over, you know he's not on all the time, so people tune in when they finally do get to see him. And, you know he plays all sorts of the shit we play, so it's uh, cause I know he played the, the Zelda Game Boy Advance games or the Game oh. Boy uh, Color games, whatever they were. Um, well, but, there's one on Game Boy. Well, the, You're uh, talking it's the, the Oracle color. games? Yeah, the Oracle, Oracle games. He played the Oracle games. He played both of them. And I know he's currently playing the Ares, uh, the new Ares. Sorry. Uh, Resident Evil. The new Resident Evil. Yeah. Well, you can forgive me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it's pronounced Ori. <laughs> but anyways, um... Well... You're, you're right, like, I think it's just getting consistent. Like, at least play once a week consistently at a time, at least if anyone wants to watch. Oh, there's always... Because I'm always going to play... I'm playing games anyway. It's just a matter of setting it up so that people could watch. Well, as I've always been corrected and told on here, people come for the streamer, never for the content. They find you because of the content. They stay for the streamer, so... And obviously you're a friendly enough guy, not too terrible of a person. You're not that bad. I'm not used to having to, you know, be entertaining while I'm playing the game. <laughs> I mean, it, it's... I mean... Like, I think this works out because you are there. Yeah, but that that that's the thing when you're... What you're doing right now is you all you need to do. You them. just do it with them and you just talk in general. If you always find yourself talking about fucking games when you're just playing games just not on in general sense than just voicing it out while you're actually just while being streaming it just that, that's pretty much most of that right there yeah. and then just being a little goofy when uh you know time permits right right so i just need to make it happen the problem is i don't have a, a ring like this i got a laptop to work as a camera so i can do yeah. Video part like that, but getting with the PS4, PS5, that makes it easy. But this is kind of more my game. Well, the the thing is, you're you can stream through the PS4, PS5. They have their own setups on those consoles. Oh, gotta hook up my. Oh, you mean you want to do Super Nintendo? Yeah, yeah. I I can do. That's what I'm saying is that I can stream oh, yeah, PS4, yeah. PS5. Yeah, really the, the biggest thing you'll need is this thing down here. What is that? That's the capture card. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if my laptop can do all that stuff. Yeah. So I, I got it mainly for work, and the work purpose was my Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's the thing. I went ahead and got this rig just for this purpose. Plus, I needed a new one anyway, so I had that old ass Mac forever. And I gave that away to Bobby, actually. Uh, you say that like I'm supposed to know Bobby. Uh, old black lady. She's the 
work at the library. Um, yeah, she worked in the, the hideaway room we, we worked in. I don't know if I saw her too often. I remember there was that, uh, grad student girl who was pretty cute. I remember, I remember she let me borrow some VHS of, so, uh, Disco Mini, I think it was called. <laughs> it's a piece of shit kidney product. Nice. But besides you, and then my brother, who worked there, I don't remember any people working in that, that room with us. Yeah. Remember Yeji? Do you remember Yeji? Yeah, Yeji, yeah, sure. Yeah, she, she always worked at the desk. And then we'd always work on it. That was fun. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Aw! But no, that's cool, I didn't know you were saying that. Oh yeah. Sorry, I don't remember. That's alright. Like I said, she only worked like a handful of hours throughout the week, so... Yeah. Did she, uh, where's she at? Uh, she's, uh, still freelancing. Um... Working, uh, just odd jobs when she has to, but, like, she freelances and does what I do. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. We need to find out. Bill's still working there. Um, did I? Yeah, we need to find out. I remember, like, three years ago, I went to that, that store in Perryford. We got lots of them. Yeah. And some guy was just telling me, yeah, I was working at the antique office. White haired man is really eccentric. I'm all about records. And I was like, Bill? <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that's an accurate fit description of like, the band. It's like awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't think he's got to be retired by now. I, I don't see that guy ever retiring. Well, like, I mean, he was like physically unable to do that. Oh yeah. Yeah, I loved his records. Still love the records, man. Oh, yeah. No, you didn't get into the hobby. Uh, I, I mean, it's just you got bigger hours at yeah. that point. Yeah, you, you, got, you got board games, magic, and uh, video games to a lesser extent. Yeah, and well, like as much as I would love to work on it, even Vanessa said she would love to work on it. It's just, yeah. Take up so, so much space. Right, I mean, if you, the board games, like, if the, they take up enough. Yeah. So, but you know me, it's video games are probably number one, and vinyls are uh, uh, Yeah, vinyls are very close second if it's not first itself, so. Yeah. Well, I just have so many. I've been collecting games a lot longer than I've been Yep. Uh, wow, this asshole's just not fucking around. That's right, I forgot about this episode. This leg was a gargoyle who was like stuck in a bell. Stuck and in a bell? The bell behind you. And like something happened to Freedom. It's like some demon Halo Halo Olympic era. And you had to like put him back in. Yeah, right in the bell. So we're just gonna have to like punch him over to the side every time it's a getting battle. I hate getting battles. Well, I mean, I don't hate them, but it just. Well, it, 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 it's gotta be done right. It's gotta be done right. If, uh, I'd like to see if we could get some more. If we can get hit once, somebody can get in the corner. Oh, you gotta do the heavy attack. When you get him, he is wide open, so it makes sense. And he's pretty telegraphs in the game. He did some experience. Oh yeah, your attack's gonna throw the board too. Yeah! I'm gonna have 
the center of uh, the whole series. Like, I have everything. Uh, yeah. All the episodes. I'll give it a look. I probably don't need to talk about this. Not fair. This last hit. Get out of here, bitch! Yeah! Yeah, like double lives I got. It's fucking terrible. Well, look at my score, man. Look at my score, man! I got, like, got 200,000 more points than you. Wow. It's also because I'm just like, hey, take care of that. Yeah, you're looking over at the chat. Trying to TCB. Hey, shh. Trying to be a good streamer, man. Now we gotta go to the fucking corner of the map. Was Final Fantasy? Well, why did <laughs> well, there's something in between? We had to go over everything. Yeah, I know. Why the fuck way out here? Man, the brownies playing with me. Browns are playing with Bears today, and if they don't win, I will probably be like, what the fuck? I don't know who's playing quarterback today. <laughs> um, I think it's Fields. Don't get hurt. And do you have any wide receivers playing for you this week? <laughs> uh, Beckham's supposed to play today, I think. Yeah. I he's still questioning. I think he is supposed to play, because someone was asking in my league if they should start him. Um, so I'm assuming he's playable. And even when we don't have receivers... Mayfield actually still does decent. Yeah, but he do a lot better. Yeah, yeah, he does better, but Mayfield elevates his teammates. It's not, we need good YRs for the quarterback. He actually is the real deal. I, I'm not saying he's Aaron Rodgers, but, you know. Aaron, Ro Aaron Rodgers wasn't Aaron Rodgers in game one. Fuck no. <laughs> Aaron Rodgers was just like, I, I think he needed the, the taste slapped out of his mouth to finally be like, okay, fuck this. I, I, I hate losing more than I hate this team. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't think New Orleans would be any good. Oh, we're, man. We're, we're in a uh, Eliminator League in one of my fantasies, and I picked Green Bay because I was like, Aaron Rodgers is probably going to want to prove something. James Winston sucks. <laughs> no, actually, no. James Winston doesn't suck. He, he doesn't suck, he just needed better guidance. He's, I don't know, because he still got their ass kicked last two Well, <laughs> all their coaches had COVID. Like, literally, they were, I think, fucking, the water boy was giving them fucking plays. Like, <laughs> like literally, all their big coaches were out on COVID. They literally were doing it on their own. And, you know, there, there's something to coaching, you know? Yeah. Well, that's true, but even in that game where they won... Um, he only had like 151 passing yards. He had five touchdowns, but yeah, but you know <laughs> him, him being a completionist and doing well, <laughs> and not and, and not at, not having him do the entire you know, not having it all on him is you know much better than what they were doing. Fuck that guy. God, there's more. There are spikes everywhere too. <laughs> I'm aware of this. Well, I didn't see the one with, like, low at first. Alright, I got this next one. Alright, they're just gonna keep coming if we don't walk. Maybe? Oh, I just... Hey, MC me! What's going on? Hi! She says hi, Keith. Hi! Nice to see ya! Thanks for joining us. Hey, MC me is actually from Ohio. Over in the, uh... Canton Akron area. Very cool. Very cool. Yes. So she's. Uh, does, she, does she care about football? That's, um, uh, that's where the. That's where the conversation's football. at right now. Yeah. Well, that was about the pro football hall of fame. So she was. Been there a few times. I think she's gone once or twice, but yeah. Um, not as much as I used to. And I think we're doing all right. Having some fun with the pirates of. Yes, yes, yes. Pirates of the Yes. 
I I'm glad you're doing all right. You don't have to work today, do you, AMC? Yes. She is a variety of streamer. She's also, uh, she likes the fancy more, like, um, she likes her anime. She likes her, um, horror content as well. Okay, well, like, what's, uh, what's something that you really like? What do you been playing lately, AMC? I certainly haven't seen any of your streams. Uh, Maybe I'll check some. But she does like playing like uh, Life is Strange. You've heard of that, right? Yeah, I love the first game. Like I see her playing that like a lot. Ah, I'll see her playing. I haven't been there in forever. She's playing Chris right now. Man, I'm not so with it. Oh no, Gris. I'm sorry. Yes, I do remember that one. How do you like that? Um, I have a copy at home, but is it, is it hard or is it just like a playing in a painting? Then Dead Cells. Yeah, I heard I heard good things about Dead Cells. Didn't, I, didn't you see some of it? I think the, I think it was your house, and then after I heard people mention it. Uh, yeah, that that game's fun. It's a great roguelike. I do need that if I can get to it. God! Okay, got two of them. You better get it. There we go. Exactly like a pity, she says. Awesome, that's what I've always heard. Gotta have it, but I'm at the age where I'm, I work a lot, and when I can get to play, it's not nearly as often, so I can't play. I think I just had like 10 games show up at my house that I bought over the past year. Huh. Mostly through like limited run. So they take you know, six months or then they come to you. And then I just, you know, like I have no idea what one to play. And Gris is one of those. Fair enough. Um, Cedar Point, interesting. Um, yeah, I don't do Cedar Point. Vanessa went to Cedar Point. You don't do times. Cedar Point ever? I'm not. I'm not a poster fan. I'm not. I got barely talking about you, Christian. Fuck you. <laughs> no, I just... I I just don't do well. Like, for some reason, it gives, me, it gives me real bad um, tension headaches. Oh, it's not the heights or anything. It's just well, not. I mean, part of it is because, like, I just... Yeah. It jerked my head around, the heights. I hate heights. Um, and then, yeah, I just, I can't, I can't. I mean, I have to be on, like, horse tranquilizer to maybe enjoy it. <laughs> then you weren't, you wouldn't enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'd be so numb, I wouldn't know, I would at least be calm. <laughs> <laughs> I used to love going to Cedar Point, but, you know, I just haven't made my way up. So I am a coaster fan. I like checking out the new stuff. Um, Especially with the past two years. Yeah, she agrees with me. You wouldn't remember you were there. Yeah, <laughs> probably for the best. Probably for the best. I have a bunch of photos of you and I. I'd buy, I'd buy all the ones on the posters. And you'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, that's me. No, man, you told me you were having a great time. I thought so. But yes, uh, yes. Great for Halloween weekends. I've heard, I've heard I've, Halloween weekends. No, I've never, never been there for uh, Halloween weekends. This like, dog. They, they do a uh, like Halloween themed stuff. Is like, is it the rides any more thematic or anything like that? I don't know if the rides are so much thematic. It's just they got like weird shows and other like features that they don't normally do. Well then, screw it. Not going on a Halloween. <laughs> oh, you don't have kids. Yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe someday. Caitlin's not a roller coaster fan though either, so it'd uh, be, uh, it'd be uh, me dragging them around. <laughs> I'll just hang out here. Ah. Like we've had that uh, conversation with uh, her sister's wife, where her sister's wife will ride roller coasters, but her sister won't. No one in her family. So it's like, well, if we ever go there, it'll just be Cat and I going on roller coasters. We'll give you guys the kids. Nice. <laughs> See ya. We're going to we're gonna have fun. They have decorations, shows, and one part has a whole bunch of smoke machines and monster walking through, scaring you. Oh. 
Is it, is it on like the on par with like a, one of those haunted houses? Supposed to be like realistic scary, or is it just a guy in a wolf mask? <laughs> booga booga. <laughs> These guys are being rude. Just let them walk in. Fuckers. Alright. And they have haunted houses set up too. Okay. Yeah, that's the thing. I just. Yeah. I. I don't really. Yeah, just. And, and that's the other thing. For how much I would even enjoy myself at certain point, I can't merit the price. And now, like. And it's been forever. It's been like probably since after just after high school since so I've gone. So it's been that long. But like Vanessa tells me how they have these stupid lines for like. There's the normal line, and then there's the fast pass ride. I like or that. the fast pass line, and then now there's the super fast pass line. I always liked because uh, I think that started to become a thing when. Uh went to Disney World when I was 16, and Fast Pass was great, because like, I think we went on uh, spring break, and it was like, we'd go home to the hotel, and it was record-breaking crowds at all the theme parks. It was like, great. But Fast Pass made it tolerable. What did you just go and that ride and get it? It's like, oh, you ride at 4 o'clock. Sweet. We'll go somewhere else then. <laughs> yeah. I like that. The super Fast Pass? Is that like, you pay a premium... Uh, you have to at that point, I guess. But that's the thing, Vanessa refuses to get the fast pass shit because in her mentality, not every other everybody should be able to like enjoy the ride. So she's like it's like boycotting almost for her. And I'm just like Yeah, so your boycott is standing in line for hours on end and getting to enjoy four rides for your entire day. Right. Your right. ten hour day at Cedar Point, however long the fuck you're there. Fast pass makes sense because if you're willing to wait, you can you can jump the line. But if you wanna wait in that line, then you can ride it. It's not all like an hour, half an hour, I think is acceptable. Yeah. Let's say uh top rides aren't on the super fast pass. That makes sense, right? Either way, I just think it's, eh. If I have to stand in line most of the time and not really get to enjoy myself, it just defeats the purpose of spending that. What, their tickets are what, 70 some bucks now? Are they? Like, yeah, I have 60 so something, long. some. I forget how much they are. Without discounts, because I know most people get them through, like, discounts through their, uh. Yeah, through employer work or somewhere. something like that. And, and a lot of people in this area buy the season passes, so you can go twice. And God, this guy hunted me down. I'm trying not to die. I fucking lizard. It's alright. Yeah, uh, yeah, she said the price was worth what we said for her. Yeah. yeah, that's. I just can't merit that. For me, I can't justify going there. But me spending $80 on a ticket to watch Kingdom Hearts Orchestra? Hell yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, that, I mean, I, I didn't think that was going to happen. Like, yeah. Well, yeah, we went, like, we went, we went the one time out that, yeah. Ago. Yeah, it was like a couple years ago, yeah. That was up in Detroit. Yeah, that there... was awesome, but um, yeah, I couldn't get my wife. Uh, girlfriend then? I don't think we were engaged yet. No, you weren't. But she, she was like, Christian wants to go with you, he'll enjoy it. Take, take your point. <laughs> All right. Um, but yeah, like I, I get that. But maybe if it was, you know, if you enjoyed it, sure, it would be worth it. What's up? Like the the game like slowed down to a halt. Like oh, we oh, beat him. We beat and, the, and then this guy just jumps out of nowhere and fucking black kicks me in the face. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, that had been happening. Like so, the, there's all those extra. Yeah, yeah. Characters, yeah, yeah. and it takes like another beat three seconds for those to die after you oh I, i'm aware but i just didn't think about it it's like more. oh we won oh what the fuck yeah i, I, just, I was not worried anymore uh play this for a second i like, I like this it's yeah. a nice little tune yeah let's just chill for a moment we don't need to exactly hurry on up this tune's awesome <laughs> we're having a great time yeah yeah 
Anyways, uh, no, like, uh, shit. Um, Vanessa, I think it's hilarious, because she's like, so, would it be weird if I asked Keith to go on a Disney play with me? I'm like, why? Disney play? Like, if she wanted to go see, like, The Lion King, or if oh. she wanted to go see, like, um, some other, like, Disney-oriented yeah, thing. Yeah, like the Broadway shows. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm like, I don't know if he would. I don't know. I would th I would assume he takes Caitlyn to those. I mean, I, I like them. They're great. Um, I've seen The Lion King and The Strain of Hand. And yeah. what other one did he see? I took my brother's wife to see Wicked because no one else wanted to go. And this is pre- Oh, he would have won. And this is pre-Caitlyn, so it was like... Yeah. And Chris didn't want to go. Um, so... Oh yeah, that's my us. thing. I, I was like, you know, I wouldn't mind going, but then she's like, you're not excited to go. I'm like, well, no, it doesn't excite me, it doesn't personally interest me. <laughs> and she, I'm like, I'm willing to go, just to check it out. I don't want you to just check it out. I'm like... Well, I didn't know this was a conversation. Yeah, it was a uh, conversation. So it was just like... Yes, I I like those things. I think they're funny. I'm like, I don't know, Keith probably likes Disney as much as you do, probably, actually, I think she eh, likes it more. No, probably more. Um, yeah. I mean, I love Disney, don't get me wrong, um, but I'm sure she likes it more. Oh, she likes it more. No, I'm gonna buy tickets for, uh, they're gonna play Waitress at the Strain of Hand, and that's the, uh, Sarah Bareilles musical. Ah. And that's one of Caitlin's favorites. I'm like, I like the music. I like a good Broadway show. I just need something to get me there. Yeah, yeah. Like, Kevin and I took Mom to see Book of Mormon, even though we were like, Mom, it's going to be a little raunchy, but it's a Broadway show, so you'll probably still enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I know she's like, I think, what was it? Would he go see Sh uh, the Shrek musical with me if I wanted to go see it? Did she not watch the one that's on Netflix? She watched it, but she's like, I see it live. <laughs> She loved musicals. So yeah. That's the other thing. She loved musicals. I'm just like... Mm. I like musicals. I never yeah. really... The, the short answer is yes. Keith would totally consider doing that because he would go himself. <laughs> yes. Yes. I'm like, I think he's more into, yeah, musicals. Yeah, I think he is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I was like, if he likes Disney, yeah, I'm pretty sure... Anyone who really enjoys Disney enough probably enjoys musicals. Well, yes. Disney... Most Disney films are basically musicals. Exactly. Um, and, you know, even growing up... you. When I was younger, I wasn't, like, enamored by him by any way, shape, or form. I was just like, you know, what? how old would I be, like? I'd be, like, nine. And I'd be like, well, I could watch a Disney film, or I could watch the last three episodes that my dad taped of Seinfeld. Guess what went in the VCR? I mean, I did both. <laughs> I mean... You can't... You, can't, you can do both. <laughs> well, I would watch the Seinfeld, then I'd be like, okay, video game time. <laughs> So, it, it, you know, it just, I, it, I would just look at Disney and be like, oh, well, I guess Erica wants to watch it, so I guess I'll watch it. <laughs> you know, that's kind of how Disney felt to me. Uh, yeah. uh, this year was the first time I've, got, I've gone in a while that I had to pay full price. Because the job usually has their company yearly appreciation there. Ah, gotcha. Yes, the, the Cedar Point. How? Yes. But, fuck, fuck but totally worth it this time, AMC? Uh, I would hope so. I would hope it's worth it. I, I just, it's just not for me. I'll pass. Oh, now we're in the Monkey Bird Village. Great, right, Monkey <laughs> Bird. Never man, the show. Monkey. Loved it! Yeah, I know, you loved your big pirates and all pirates and oh. tattoo man. <laughs> well, there are only one of probably each one of these pirates in that show, so. Throwing them around everywhere. Come on, come on around. Does your does your character ever get a full sword? Uh, no, that's part of the uh, character. It's just, it was like his dad's and it broke, and now he uses it like that, so it's basically a like, Wow. No, you gotta watch the show. You can't explain that. He is insistent I watch the show. I'm not, not saying I wouldn't, not I'd saying I wouldn't. I recommend it to everybody who watched the show. And maybe if you did, they would reboot it. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, that's what it is. See, see, you're pandering to me to enjoy something for 
your benefit in the end. It would be your benefit because you would like it. <laughs> if they were rebooting it, except then you wouldn't have to wait 30 years for it, it to come out if, like I If did. anyone says people are completely selfless, they are completely wrong. No one is ever that truly selfless. <laughs> There's always a motive. I've done plenty of stuff. Oh, I didn't know there was a pit there. Plenty of stuff. Help your ass out. Without <laughs> asking for anything. Ah, uh, that is true. How many times have I moved you? You've only done it once. You no, you I've, I've done it more than once. I know, you offered more than once, but the last time you, you were like, ah, oh, I can't do it, I'm busy. I no, remember, I, remember I, I, I took some selfies and it was just like, no thanks to you, Christian. No, that was the last time you moved. You helped me move, you load the truck when I moved to Mississippi. And then I helped you move shit into your other bachelor pad before you got with Caleb. Because I remember moving something in there. Yeah, I moved shit in there, yeah. Okay, okay, I believe you. Yeah. Well, thank, thank you, retroactively. You know, I probably said it then too, but... Thanks again. Yeah. I don't remember that. I had a lot of people. Oh, you motherfucker. I made, I made more pit. lives you're gonna lose here, buddy. I only lost the one. I just fell in the pit. I got knocked into the pit. Yeah, this place is the pits. Ah, ah, ah. Come on, lady pirate. You have to, like, you have to grapple. Okay, oh. Maybe yeah, she just didn't like me. Yeah, I was too manly. You know who Hector Elizondo is? No. Do you remember? Do you ever watch Last Man Standing? I've watched some episodes because Vanessa had a thing. Or has a thing for Tim Allen? No, not. Has <laughs> a strange thing to say. <laughs> He's the star of that no, show. I, I mean, I get it, but no, she had had the episodes going at some point during our relationship. So yes. Uh, I've seen some episodes just so randomly. You know who is the boss? The white hair and bald runs the outdoor man. I'm off the top of my head, no. I just, uh, they were a couple years back and I only saw some of the episodes, so. Well, the only reason I was mentioning it is that guy does the voice of the character you're playing as. Ah. Better gotcha. And he's a great character actor. Very unique voice. I guess if if you're into that sort of thing, it's you know, another obvious thing. Great actor in roles and movies. Shit. I don't want to jump in. Fucking. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Bullshit! It was kind of bullshit. What is this fucking platforming? It was at least this is better than Double Dragon. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, they all had, they all had to do something like that. Yeah, just, yeah, like, Double Dragon it. 4. Let, let's bring up Double Dragon 4 and that nonsense. Oh my. Oh, whoa, whoa, I didn't think it was gonna restart me back here. See, there's a benefit here, though, because then I can just yeah, throw, throw They're them. coming at me. And... I guess you can just stay there. Uh, I guess. This is why your score is so high. Nah, you weren't always falling in the fucking pit. Yeah. Double Dragon 4 is That what, one wasn't that bad. It was it, not it was not bad until just, we it, got to that one level. Oh, it's on your platform. <laughs> Die. But we got to that one level where it was nothing but pure platforming and hope to God pray that there's a platform on the next screen when we jump. Right. Yes. That was bad. That's I forgot about that. It wasn't it, it dude, we had lives and then we realized we didn't. <laughs> Not because we're loser nerds that was playing the fucking dra Double Dragon at fucking 12 o'clock in the morning. It was because we could not get through that level. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's the nerd part. That's okay. Oh, come on. Nah, see, I think that is just giving you an extra it's not Yeah, it did. It did. Can, we, can you reach it? Yeah. Have you take it? Take it out. We're trying. We'll go eventually. There we go. Fuck! Oh, fucking rain! Fire! Yeah! You guys can't reach us! That's still... Yeah, D-Rider? 
You, you had to say it, didn't you? <laughs> you can't reach us. <laughs> uh, so this is easily been is gonna get cut for some of my uh oh shit <laughs> oh my god why why are you doing this sorry it did not start running when it was supposed to this is gonna get cut for what um no this is i'm gonna have to make this cut for the uh what you might call it um i i plan on doing some be right back screens doing some like like showing some like favorable moments of my stream. And you fucking fall in the pit four times. Yeah. <laughs> Should be honest. Yeah, just it'll just do cuts of this game. It'll just do cuts <laughs> of this game, and this this is a good day for it. Like, <laughs> ow! You literally just punch, stop punched me right there. That was terrible. His arms are really long. This guy reminds me of. Uh, Blaster, you know, from a Mad Max. Oh yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. These guys can die. I don't think I've even used the special. It's I I've hate. used it very rarely. I hate when the specials take away. Like, just make it well, like a three-time use thing. The special is meant to be a defensive thing anyways in these type of games. I mean, I know you're right. It just it makes it never oh, used. come on, it's more of this game. shit? Which is the button I never touch. I need you to get your ass over here. <laughs> I'll take the lead so when I rock. <laughs> what the fuck? I was just about to say. Fuck this game! I... <laughs> fuck its mother! And fuck the hole that it came from! Fuck this game! This is the fifth time you've fallen in a pit here. <laughs> oh my god! I was gonna say, uh, I'll take the lead so if a rock comes, I'll get hit right when you got hit before. You I know what I would appreciate if you had fucking said sooner! <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, I got credit? Okay. <laughs> maybe, maybe you should wait until I can uh, get us past this. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try the bitch. <laughs> what is this game again? The characters look familiar. Name? Name of the game. Pirates of Dark Water. The Pirates of Dark Water. Uh, there was a cartoon for it when we were younger, uh, AMC. And it was great. She watched it, she said. Oh, yeah? See? Did, did, did you, uh, enjoy it? Because I've been trying to convince Christian here to watch it. I, it's not like you dead. You, what are you like? Yeah, my arm feels a little twisted, sure, but I'm <laughs> sure I'll watch it at some point. She will. She loved it. Well, if, if it has her stamp of approval, I will definitely watch it. The annoying bird. I love the bird. The Mid Mid Midler. <laughs> Voiced by Roddy McDowell himself. And she has no right to call anything annoying. Um, not saying that it's annoying, but she she has she's she's fond of her little songs. She does songs. So like she she has little songs she does for when people like donate and do subs and stuff. Oh yeah. And she likes to sing and she'll sing these little songs she comes up with. That's that's cool. And I, it's I it's that. cute. It's cute. I can respect that. Uh my uh wife, I sing songs to her and the cats all the time. They're usually just like recognizable popular songs, but I change all the lyrics. <laughs> but uh but yeah, she wears this nice little hat. Um I don't know what I'm watching at. Anyways, she wears this nice little hat, she'll like duck and like the hat will like do some little thing because she'll pull on the <laughs> Oh <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's some of this. Yeah, it's cute. I gotta, I gotta remember. 
AMC. AMC me. Uh, she, she's a frequent contributor to the stream. She'll, uh, she'll be around. But, uh... Or you can follow my stream if I ever run. <laughs> well, normally people follow just... I don't know how many times I see people be like, I'm not a streamer, why are y'all following me? <laughs> it's like, oh, people follow. That's just... People... You never know. Most people who... Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, what the Wait, fuck did is... Just what did the game change? <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? Why do I have a monkey bird and you get a fucking dragon? Because you're a piece <laughs> of shit. All of a sudden, I'm playing this goddamn shooter. It's a ground shooter. What the fuck? Yeah, Christian didn't put it in the uh, description because I don't stream much. I do have a Twitch. I've just only done, like, two streams ever. And they were more testing to see if I could do it. But you realize you can't really do it all that well, or... You never really told me what came out of this time. Um, I, I was making sure the headset worked, and then I got on there, I mean, it worked. It's just I think I wanted to do more of a framework, kind of like what you have. I didn't yeah. have a cam set up, so it was just my disembodied voice. And it was just, I was playing Control at the time, and it was, a lot of, it was a lot of me just going, like, silence, silence, silence. Oh, shit! Fuck! <laughs> and then it was just silence again. <laughs> So, I can't imagine it was terribly interesting to watch, but yeah. played with it a little bit more. And, uh, Every, everybody that. starts out like that. AMC's <laughs> right. Everybody starts out like that. Don't worry. Well, I appreciate that. She streamed from her PS4 initially, just the PS4. That's and, what I figured. It's, it's like anything, you know. You're not going to be an expert just starting out. Yeah, see, that, I was a little different because I had the background from, like, college yeah with with the stuff it, well not that it's just the video and audio properties and stuff like that too mm -hmm. like knowing all that so i knew going in is like and i had studied so i was like people need good mic people need good lighting people need you know i, I kind of just had a general sense so starting up people were like wait how long you been doing this I'm like a week <laughs> well, I guess it's nice I have uh, you as kind of a backstop, too, that I can bounce yeah. ideas off of. Yeah, I just thought it looked fun, just jumped in. Yeah, I've been wanting to do this for probably three years prior to when I started. Yeah, I mean, this. I, I my thought process is I'm playing the games anyway. Might yeah, well just, exactly. Might as well just spend an extra 20 minutes set up and yeah. I have company going to it. Yeah, that's kind of how I felt, and it's just like, well, you know, I can do fun stuff too, and you know, you know, er, you know, when people normally see it, they're like, wow, you're just what people pay you, paying you to play video games. I'm like, no, they're paying me to create content and entertain them. Yeah. I, I had to basically tell somebody this is basically a, a live Kickstarter. Yeah. Uh, in a sense, that's I had to describe that to someone because they were a board gamer and they were like not understanding why they would pay me to like just use like my emotes and stuff. It's I'm like it's not just that. Uh, it's like there's a, I, there was other things tied to it. When I compared it to being a live Kickstarter, they were like, I get it now because <laughs> they back a lot of Kickstarters for board games. So it's like I had to like yeah really bring it down for them. No, that's. I might start that. Yeah, drop my thing in there. Yeah, it's yeah. People have a head start. Yes, yes, yes. It's yes. something you reflected to me. What the fuck is this thing? Can I, can I attack that? It's fucking... It's constricting. I forgot in the show, the ship has, like, a monster. And they throw it. The pirates who have failed. Ah. So probably breaking out. Fair enough. So, yeah, it has no health bar, so I'd say stay away from it. Yeah, it's just like another crab, right? Swings. Yep. My, my bitch does little to no damage. I told you. I got it. Like, Ren was the and it's not hard, so I haven't really played it that much because every time I sit down to play it, I feel like it's Alright, before we move on, I'll have to type it real quick. 
top. What's the, uh... Mine's the... Green key. It's all lowercase, right? Yeah. There we go. Yes, yes. That, yeah, that, yeah that. May, maybe not that soon, but we're, we're doing it right now. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes. So that, that would be Keith's Twitch, if you were curious. Yes. Like I said, he does come on the channel every so often. Not as often as I think he should, but... Well, you know, we can make that happen. We can do a Saturday morning. Yeah. Always good. Like, that's, we're always watching football. Oh, we can watch football at Hell yeah, hell yeah. Oh, well, thanks, Ames. I appreciate that. Like I said, I, gotta, I got nothing planned right now, but we'll see. I've been talking with Christian more and more about it, and I can do an easy setup. I've been playing uh, Neo on my PS5. How's that? Um, I mean, it's, it's tough as nails, <laughs> but uh, once you start figuring it out, it gets pretty rewarding. Supposed to be a uh, multiplayer, like you can play with uh, other people somehow. I'm not really sure how that would work with it, the way the dynamic of the game is, but. Alright. Die! How many, how many more levels we got? Um, I think this might be the last one. Okay. I was just noting the time. Yeah. I, I, when we were at about four treasures, which is. Fair enough. Man, it's like death by a thousand cuts with this bitch. <laughs> so, Call her dresser by her name. To, uh, <laughs> I mean, I think Chinese water torture can kill things more effectively than this bitch does. Good. Eat it. Well, it's a shame we're only going to get through this game. I thought we might be able to get a, uh, another, another, another thing in with wow. the Thunder Spirits or UN Squadron, because we weren't getting through either of those and just shooters. Well, I, I, I was, I was one, I, you know, I have been interested in some shooters playing them on my own anyway, so, I mean, I will play through some at well, some point. You got them now, so, uh, you're welcome, as always, anything that I have, you're welcome to us. So. Of course. You, you heard it. You heard it live. I have. I have the permissions. Oh, yeah, I, I pretty much told these people I pretty much had the permissions. If I need a game, that's how you always go to you first. Except for uh, Sonic 6. Because you know why have bad games, right? And Zombie Match and Zombie Master watches the uh, the the VOD later. Yes, it's a bad game. Depends. Like, I own Night which is not really a bad game, but it's it's not the way I would design the game. I really would just like to watch the half an hour of footage as one full thing. Oh, AMC, are you a fan of Fatal Frame? I have to ask. That seems like that. Oh, yes, that's, I've heard them talk about it before, too. Oh my god, I can't wait for it. I've seen people play it, it's great. Oh. I got the first one. He brought the first one, the one on the SNES, the Super Nintendo. No, 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 you're thinking that's different. Clock Tower. Oh, Clock Tower, you have Clock Tower, okay. Yeah, Fatal Frame is different, yes. I get where you get the confusion. Yes, yes. Yes, Clock like, Tower. Fate, Clock Fate Tower's the game. first one was on PS2. You're right, it's all you're about right. The camera. You're right, I, I got, but yeah. Clock Tower, we got the first, the first one we got was on PS1. But it, it, it's similar, like, you, very little things you can do to defend yourself. You died again. Dude, she sucks. But yeah, yeah. He, sh he showed me the Super Nintendo game, and I'm just like, wow, okay. So, so AMC, how about Clock Tower? Yes, Clock Tower. The correct game, you Yes, yes. I'm like some board game. Well, that is 
but I don't think that's seen that. Name? There is a um, YouTuber named Snestrum that does like many reviews. They're like less than five minutes. Kind of gets get you the idea. I got it. It never came out in the United States, so I have a reproduction copy that has translations. Um, I said Christian should play that in October. That's, that's unlike anything else on the Super Nintendo. And I'm all about playing unique, interesting games, so this is... Yeah, there are a bunch of sequels. Uh, what's that? What's the name sounds familiar. There are a bunch of ones on, like, PS2. And yeah, PS3. that, yeah, yeah, I forgot. It's like, they, they had so many of these type of games coming out around that time. So Roman Reigns on WWE has been like super awesome lately with his heel gimmick, and he's all about telling the crowd to acknowledge him. So now it's been like a popular word to use. You're gonna acknowledge me. Man, that's all he does. He just stands there and he just looks at everyone like he threw his nose. You get. You will acknowledge me. <laughs> Yeah, 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 I, yeah, I see you there. Yeah, it's very, and he, he, he's, he had the face run for the longest time. People were so tired of him. Then he comes back and he's just like a complete dick now. <laughs> and he's like, I'm the bloodline. I'm, you know, popular bloodline on WWE with all the, like, past, like, family members who have, like, wrestled in the past. So, like, you know, I'm, I'm the head of the table. I'm the tribal chief, you know. I, 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 I'm where I'm at because I put food on the plate for everybody at home, you know? You know, he, he's right, the real right. dick about it. He's all like... Right, all right, I get it, dude. Yeah, it's fucking hilarious. Like, he, he just like, this shit is just hilarious. But it's, it's not the best work I've seen in some time. And it's just like, man, when you can finally get someone you can just legit eat. Good, I mean, I know you've always liked wrestling. That's never really been my thing. You pointed out some cool stuff. But, but yeah, like, I know my buddy Archer and I have been doing that wrestling collaboration for how long? <laughs> Which, yeah, or like, you're one of the villains. Right yeah, yeah, well, I do, yeah, I do commentary with him, and yeah, I kind of try to be a bit of a dick about it. <laughs> um, it's a good thing it's not part of the stretch for you. Yeah, it's it's not. Um, but anyways, no, it's uh, it's been a good time. He had to uh, redo the whole thing to on the latest uh, WW2K20. Because his 2K18 game like literally took a shit on him, like he corrupted his file and the game quit working on its own. Like it was really weird. He's like, it literally ate the file. I'm like, yeah. So he he had like 30 plus, 30 plus characters created from Twitch streamers and whatever. And everything he re he had to recreate everything for for the new game, which the new game. When it released, was awful. I've told you about this. How yeah, bad it was. Yeah. Well, they've patched it up enough now to where it's very playable, but you can't go full bore with customization because it will crash the system. God damn, flying pirates are the worst. When that happens, like that's an extreme case. I was playing uh, like Tomb Raider, the modern remake, the first one. Yeah. And I was like being very meticulous, getting 100% and all these like challenges and shit. And the game told me I was like 91% of the way through the game. And then I crossed some autosave field and I fell down the crevice. Yeah. And then every time I tried to load that file, it took like 
crash that guy. <laughs> and I was like, ah. Yep. And oh, I just we never got back to it. We have that on here too. Come on, take care of those guys. Fuck! Yeah, we yeah. <laughs> we have that on here too. Yeah, for the last like two weeks it's been like annoying because like a lot of the sound effects were not working that I like to use on here that people can redeem and do anytime during the stream. Um, so, like, apparently I was having a lot of issues with my DNS, if you know what that's about. It's like, when you're, it's the, uh, your browse, like, your internet browser's ability to look up your internet provider signal, something like that, yeah. And, well, for some reason it was super slow, and it was, like, we failed, like, looking for it, and I'd have to, like, refresh page pages multiple times and shit for it to like load up the page and it was really weird um, sometimes when I would click the start stream it wouldn't even start I would have to hit start stream again or whatever because it just wouldn't like find it so I heard some other streamer had that issue on uh, that here and I was about that yeah because I know yeah the internet could be a bitch very complicated. It's like one thing goes wrong. It does. It, it does. And like because the sound blurbs have to rely on my internet to search through where they're coming from as a source. So when people activate them and my internet being as wonky as it was, like the blurbs were not working. They just they would redeem it and nothing would show up. Because I wasn't fully connected to the uh, source because my internet was just not working. So, yeah, it was just... Eventually, I finally found a fix after 10 million different, like, um, remedies that I tried to fix it. Like, I did, like, DNS, cash flushes, and shit like that left and right. But apparently, now I have it set up on this PC to where it, the network adapter goes through the Google DNS. Okay, Instead of the DNS provided by my uh, Spy Spectrum. And now it works. Now everything works like a charm. I tried doing it on my router, because there was a place on your router you could do it, like inside the router settings, and it wouldn't do it. Like, even when I did it on there, it didn't change anything. It was weird I had to do it on. So, like, yeah. But it is what it is. Now everything works, and I'm not having any issues, which is. Because I was about ready to call Spectrum be like, what the fuck's the deal? I literally almost tried everything until, like, I saw something else. I, it was probably, like, the eighth fucking uh, tutorial or, like, list of, like, fixes I've seen on the internet. <laughs> and I was just like, well, this one sounds different than all the other ones I've tried. I'll, I'll try this one. And, yep, it worked. Nice. Well, that's the other thing that's nice. I mean, you can... You can find the solutions. Uh, anytime I've ever had a question like that, I've been able to find a or troubleshooting site that solve my problem. Oh, yeah. Wow, time at 18. Let's speed this up, shall we? can't help it. That's not my problem. The other ones are just sending the shit out here and have double life bars. I know, right? Well, look, the time only would click out. I know, the time hasn't been going down super fast. I think it's like five minutes. Oh my god. Yeah, like I said, most of my audience would be available later in the evening. Notably on Sunday, probably. Yeah. Yeah. We just said this impromptu, and we were really going to do it. Gonna lurk while I finish watching my K-drama. I got one more episode left. 
No problem, ma'am. See, thanks for stopping in. Have hey. yourself a wonderful day if I don't see you later. Hey, AMC, if you see this before you go, what's the K-drama? Well, the reason I was asking is because Netflix just came out with that new show, Squid Game, ah. and it is from South Korea, and very much a drama, and I thought that was it. Is it anime, or is it real life? It's live action. Okay. It was, like, fascinating. It was super messed up, but fun. Well, the South Koreans have a very interesting way of presenting the shit that's messed up because of how long their lives have been messed up for so long. Right, right, right. Well, there's lots of that on the show. That, uh, but yeah. Squid Game. Squid Game, I would highly recommend. My wife and I watched all nine episodes over the course of two nights. And they were all an hour episode. An hour. That sense of I feel like that was hard to miss. It was like on the front page. Oh, yeah. Uh, I might have to give that a look. Interesting. Hey, is this guy? I think this is the end. Is it like a boss rush? Yeah. Might actually get a game over, man. Yeah, I know what a few of those are like. <laughs> Die! I'm say throw here in the center. Fuck! He's cheating. <laughs> the boss, man, the being I know. Fucker. Yeah! But yeah, we, we will play some Streets of Rage 4 since you have not played it at some point soon. Probably next time we play. Because... I mean, one of the last times we hung out, we played through... Is that my old house, though? Uh, the, street, the original Streets of Rage. Yeah, it was, yeah, that was a few years ago. Yeah, I haven't owned my house in at least two years. Yeah, I'm closer to three. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's my fear. Like... Get like a bachelor pet, like a house like that, and then like immediately selling it, kind of like you did. I mean, I made ten grand. Out of the first wow, you did make ten grand. <laughs> okay, I got. I sold it for more than I paid for. How, how did that work? Did you? You didn't really renovate, did you? I mean, I. The only things that I did were stuff that I really had to do. It was just the market. Yeah, that's. I was about to say that next. I'm like the market probably went up then, probably. Had to open. Yeah, like, so it worked out for me. What I really wanted to do was rent it to someone, so, like, uh, uh, yeah, or the air player sucks so bad you're not picking them. <laughs> That's right! Well, that might be true. But, uh, Tula but I, I want... is Tula. <laughs> I wanted to rent it out to a friend, but, like, if I still had it, I'd be like, yeah, fresh, 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 fresh. Yeah, yeah, I know. Now, now would be one of those times where I kind of like wish that was a thing, but not at the time, I guess. Yeah, like, I, you were, you had that. I was cheap still working. Yeah. Living in uh, working in Australia. Yeah. And you had such a good right there. I was like, I can't really. Do that. Yeah, <laughs> it was, yeah. It was like I had it was four hundred a month plus. I had a roommate, so it was like. Yeah, it was like real nice. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Like one shot at you. <laughs> yeah, he, well, he's a dick. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, like you're stupid. You can't, like, really pick him up, I think, because he's just strictly heavy. Normally, I pick him up and do a couple of hits, throw him. All right, I use. We're down to one credit level. Yeah, like this. We, we should be fine. I think we should be good. Oh, I was able to pick him up there. 
Well, I meant like the top. You can't only hold the top. See how little his health bar is going here. He got me anyway. God, I was, God. I was like waiting for that and like, trying to avoid it. Ah. Got up, yeah. All right. You go in and distract him. I'll punch him down. Wait, is that not it? I think it's like gas. We'll give you all your health back if you beat the game. <laughs> Fair enough. We'll see. Let's move that along. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Look at all these points we got. I'm sure it'll matter to somebody. What? What? Yeah, still Recorded age. live! <laughs> what, like... Yeah, someone... Or... Yeah, I can look it up. Well, like, when was it? Yesterday? Or, no, it was the other day. My buddy Cornhusk, who uh, AMC and I are familiar with. We, uh... <laughs> we, uh... He was playing Zombies Ate My Neighbors. And I... I was like, dude... You haven't got past level 10? What's wrong with you? You know, and he's like, well, well, I'd like to know when, how, I, wh what level you got up to. I'm like, dude, the last time I played, I got the 31. <laughs> he's like, whatever, I don't believe you. <laughs> I'm like, I got proof. Dude, I record everything. Mm -hmm. And he's like, whatever, show me the VOD. <laughs> and I, I went back, I'm like, I'll look on my YouTube. I'm like, oh shit. The one I did, uh, the one I did 31 one was a Discord, like, private show. Oh. I'm like, uh, nope, I don't have it. This one only goes up to, like, 13 or some shit. I'm sorry. He was like, I knew it. <laughs> you are worthless. I don't know. I, I don't think I do that well on that myself right away. Yeah. When you and I played it, we made it far, but you remembered it a lot better than I did. Yeah. I, I was just like... Uh, there was just things about it. It was just like, oh my god, I remember this. Oh, now I remember that. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Uh, still fun. I'm glad they re-released on the Switch. So. Yeah, I would have brought it, but I remember they did that. And I, I ordered a copy from them to run as well. Ah. Uh, that was, that was their thing. Like, I was like, oh, they also got Ghoul Patrol on there too? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Which is notably harder. Right. Gosh. I tried playing a little bit of that. I'm like, what the fuck's this shit? It's like taking the fun and being like, we'll strip it of that. Now you. <laughs> oh, that, what thing that... did you like? No, 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 get rid of it. <laughs> now, now you're going to have to fight for your life for everything. You just want to walk in this room. Now you got five different things attacking you in this room at once. <laughs> Enjoy your day. Yeah, that's, that's what we got here. Well, I hope if anyone cared to read this, yeah, yeah that, that's that's why. I, to it at all. Well, I've been. What the fuck? Hitler, man. Oh my god. He, he wants to eat. I'm starving. Yeah, we'll get some lunch. The comic relief. Come on. We'll get some lunch. <laughs> it'll, it'll, it'll be fine. <laughs> oh man. But yeah, that's the first time Christian played it, beat it, together. <laughs> yes. So this was a great game, uh, uh, The Pirates of Dark Water. It was a great high game. adventure. High adventure. <laughs> Keith, would you like to explore the edge of the world with me? <laughs> <laughs> that was the, uh, what, opening cutscene? The opening cutscene of Arkham Nepishtim. Yeah, yeah, Wise, wise uh, Arkham Nepishtim, yeah. Seven, I think. 
you, you are the great animal, <laughs> or the young animal, or the red haired well, animal. It's the red haired animal. So, how about it? Why don't you come and explore the world with me? <laughs> Just out of the blue, this is the first thing you see. It's great. But I, some people don't understand why I find why we find that so hilarious. I tell other people this and it's lost on them. Like, what's so funny? I'm like, I mean, it's because we were there together and now. But, it, but it's the weirdest thing. Like, it was super weird. It's super weird. But yeah, Pac Man. You know, go ahead. Pac-Man, thanks for the fist bumps, my friend. Yes, this is the Yeah, me nice. too. Yes, that's oh. what we do. Anyways, yeah, I never got to play through it. I never well, actually sat down and played Because it. I played that part, because that's when you had the two TVs next to each other in your apartment in BG. I, no. Maybe it was. Regardless, we were playing it. I, I started playing it, and we saw that cutscene cracked up. And then uh, you let me borrow it, and I got through it. But I was like... Yeah, it's like a Zelda clone. You go around, you hack yeah. and flash, it's fine. And you were like, yeah, I sold that sh piece of shit. I, like, I didn't say it was a piece of shit. <laughs> uh, well, I was more cavalier about getting rid of games back then. I kind of wish I haven't, or I didn't, but... Um, I mean, again, you focused on your board game hobby, so it makes sense. Uh, well, yeah. I I've contemplated, like, whittling my collection down just because... I don't play them enough. And... and yeah, there's some board games here that I do want to whittle down and just get rid of because they're obviously games. Like, I got Star, Pe Star Trek Panic over there. Didn't you own that too? Yeah, I got yeah, it you for got... Uh, Christmas one year. Yeah, you got that. And, you know, it's okay. It's not great. Yeah. You know, it's yeah, it's I actually quite frustrating. I had a lot of fun with it, but I also, you know, I'm probably bigger star trek fan than you so it's cool to have that well i mean it wasn't like I, well, yeah but i like star I know, trek i know it's the game itself that you're criticizing yeah I, I like star trek enough and just yeah the game itself some of the mechanics were kind of like oh because i do have the original castle panic <laughs> down there somewhere but yes it was just one of those uh it's just a fun castle defense game but yeah there was just some certain rules in star trek that was just like Okay, this thing's gonna be out a while. We're not gonna beat it <laughs> until <laughs> something particular happens. I think the one time we played it, this is when I got it. We played it with uh, my wife's family, and we beat it the first time. But we had a long time to play. Like, you know, it was eight o'clock, and we could play until midnight if we wanted. Oh yeah. But uh, yeah, we got through one whole game. I don't think. Uh, I think that's it for us, though, because it's NFL time officially. Oh, 103. yeah. 103. NFL time. And like I said, we are not with computers other than maybe Pac-Man. Like I said, impromptu streams, especially on Sunday mornings, uh, I don't get a whole lot going on with Sunday mornings. But no, that's all right. Well, I appreciate Pac-Man giving us the fist bump and watching the whole time. But yeah, for any of you guys that do um, come back and around and watch the pod, uh, yeah, check out this game. It's a very interesting beat em up. It's just fun in general. Yeah, fun, not too hard, but rewarding. Um, go to about the middle of the game, and uh, or this video specifically, and you can watch Christian die about seven times. Oh, God. <laughs> but, anyways, I uh, appreciate everybody that came in. And, uh, anyways, uh, have a good one. I will be back uh, later this evening for, for the Civ. So, Pac Man will play Civ later. And, uh, yeah. Enjoy yourselves. Take care. Thanks, everybody.